hello today i'm going to show you how you can perform insert update delete display search using edges in asp.net c sharp so advantage is this will work without refreshing the page so first of all we have to create new website so i'm going to create website we need blank website now click ok and now here we have to add one page so this is the default.asps page and now add okay now we are here and now we are going to write here table text inside tr inside td we are going to add two column name and city so city now here we need one text box so td and here i can write input type text and we need id so i'm going to write id t1 okay now i am going to copy this paste here and i am going to write here t2 means different id now again i need one tr td and i need one button so i am going to write here input type button i need id b1 and i need value insert now i am going to run this okay now you have to perform this insert operation but before that we need one table so i am going to add here server explorer click here and create new database database name is testing for and now i am going to click okay yes this database is not exist so they asked us would you like to create it yes it will take some time to create database yes our database is here now here inside the table right click here add new table and we have to create one table with two field name and another field is city now i am going to control s save this table and table name should be table one okay now here we are going to use edges so we uh, take one on click event in this we are going to pass one function function name i write insert now here i am going to take script type that's our script in video we are going to show insert update delete display search every everything but i will show you this all operation in one by one video so first of all i am going to take your function insert now here i am going to take two variable name in this name i am going to take first export value so like this get element by id t1 dot value now i am going to take another variable in this variable i am going to take city okay now variable xml http now uh, this uh, code for edges new xml tree we request xml http dot send not open here we have to give three parameter get and here false now uh, we take one more page page name should be insert dot asps here we have to pass two variable nm is equal to name this line is most important so if you get any types of error then please check it you are doing any mistake or not and city is equal to plus city so we take two variable name and city then xml http dot send null three 
So now I'm going to check this. This is okay. Yes, everything is okay. So now we need to create one page, and I am going to remove this space. Not require this space. Now I am going to add one more page. Page name should be insert. Add. Now right click here and go on view code. View to right here insert operation using system dot data dot. First of all, using system dot data, then using system dot data. dot sql client and now here we have to use sql connection sql connection con is equal to new sql connection and here at the red sign and uh, our database is testing for so right click here then go property then select this connection string copy and paste now we pass two value from default .sps this is my one variable na nm and this is my second variable cnt so here i have to write like this so first of all i have to create two variable over here string name string ct and now name is equal to request dot query string nm dot to string and yes this this is most important consider this nm is this uh, no 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 this and this cnt so i have to write here cnt in another variable ct and here ct okay. now i am going to do insert operation so first of all i have to do connection open then connection close then sql command cmd is equal to connection dot create command then cmd dot command type is equal to command type dot text then cmd dot command text and cmd dot execute non query okay now we are we have to write insert query insert into table 1 and values and here my laptop battery is low but no problem we will complete this plus plus and then we have to write name dot to string and here city dot to string okay now right click here and made set a startup page and now i am going to run this and i am going to write here amit and ct rajkot now press insert and we are going to check here we get record or not right click here and show table data Yes, we get here Amit and Raj code, but after uh, insert record, we have to uh, clean these two text spots, and we have to give notification to user. So write like this: t1 dot value is equal to blank, t2 dot value is equal to blank, and then we can pass here a lot record inserted. successfully okay now i am going to run again andipra and rajkot and now insert our record inserted successfully we get message and now we are going to check in table we get record or not 
yes you can see here we get a record but the most advantage is we perform this using edges so i will show you again we get this all output without refreshing the page like uh, see here anything process happened or not insert you can see there is no process over here means page is not loading so this operation is completed using gadgets means without refreshing the page and my next video i am going to show you how you can display record using gadgets in asp.net csr thank you so much for watching my video